All right, cool. Three, two, one, boom. Cutscene. For Yuri, have you seen him? Probably sleeping. He's somewhere in town. Probably sleeping. Hmm. Also, emotional cutscenes too. Who can successfully hide from me? He's not trying hard, honey. In any case, what are you doing, Flynn? Patrolling. This town has no barrier, so I have to work extra hard to keep it safe. What is it? Why are you the one patrolling? You're a commandant. Or is this part of a knight's duty? It has nothing to do with a knight's duty or rank. A knight is... Well, it's difficult to explain. I mean, you defend the people. It's not that hard to explain. Personally, I believe they exist solely to protect the people. But not all knights agree. Then things haven't actually gotten any better? No. They've improved quite a bit. But there are those who don't believe so. Lies and rumors are insidious things. Yes, but you need them to live a fun life sometimes. Ah, oh, Flynn. You have far too many woes for one so young. Excuse me? True. I have no want for trouble, but I am prepared to face it. Is that right? Ever since I learned the law is imperfect, I've looked for a definitive boundary between good and evil. Recent events have shown me that no such boundary exists. In the end, all I can do is face each trouble as it arises. Perhaps this path is full of pain, but I won't run. That's what I am prepared for. Yay! Hmm. The, the Aristudius Knight. Admirable, but God's wallop. What? Long ago, I led the pirates as I freed. But I was only their boss because they had all given me their support. And had Yuri and the okay. others not been there when my memories returned, I'm not sure what would have happened. Without them... I wouldn't be the chipper lass I am today. That's good. You don't have to bear your troubles alone. You have Yuri and me. We all have troubles. And all your friends. So we should work together to figure them out. Together? Yes. You're right. Thank you, Patty. You know, sometimes I can't... Sweet music time. You are terribly mature. <laughs> it's all right. You aren't the first to fall for my intoxicating charms. Okay, Patty, you're pushing it now. If we all work through our troubles together, then someday we'll be able to make the world we dream of a reality. Everything we do, starting with taking down the Autophagos, will be worth it. Oh, yeah. Resolving to act on a decision influences those around you, and then that decision becomes reality. Sorry guys, I'm going to jump into TV a little bit. I want to hear the song right now. Is this what I think it is? Sorry for echo if you hear it. I think this is the main theme. I think this is a version of Ring a Bell. Ring, ring, ring. Yeah, Ring a Bell. That's how whole worlds are created. Yep. <sighs> Sink me. I'm losing out on my beauty sleep. Off to bed I go. What about Yuri? I'm young. I'm sure there'll be plenty more chances. Good night. Good night. Uh -huh. Don't bear your troubles alone. I mean, that's a very good lesson, is don't bear your troubles alone, because that is something that people generally forget. Can't sleep? What about you? Oh, I was just out talking with Baul and it got late. I was just checking on how the repairs were coming along. <laughs> what? Oh, nothing. Oh, I hate it when you say that. Rita, you changed that's a lot. Strange. I don't mean anything by it. Hey, what are you going to do after this is over? 
If all goes right, all the Blastia will stop working, including Hermes Blastia. Right. You won't have anything to do. I guess not. I mean, you hang off us, Del. That's all I had. Baul was my only friend. Destroying Hermes Blastia was my only purpose. I mean, I had my reasons, but... But? After traveling around with you all, I guess... I don't really care anymore. You're just gonna drop it like that? I mean, she kind of asked you, and she's gonna have nothing to destroy. What are you going to do? You lived for your Blastia research. Th there's tons of stuff I could study. Besides, I realize there are things I can believe in besides Blastia. Estelle and people. I don't people. have any family, so I don't. But uh, I kind of like, you know. Oh crap! I had to dial up fast. Hey, that's just between us. You can't tell anybody. I mean, she probably I will. won't. I promise. <laughs> It's fun to have secrets with someone. True. Unless you're really bad at keeping secrets. You never would have said anything like that when we first met. <sighs> All the different people, different things on this journey, you know? Yeah, I do. I never dreamed I'd end up like this. Me neither. When everything's done, maybe I'll just travel the world with Bauo. That sounds nice. That's nice. Hey, take Estelle too. There's still a lot in this world she should see. You're not coming? It'll be so lonely without you. To cast fireballs? Uh, well, I guess I could. That'd be fun, Rita. Go, go have some fun. You're 14? You know, I, I always believe, like, games take, like, a couple of years to finish in, like, actual game days and whatnot. So, I mean, she was 14 when she started. Let's say she's around 15 and Judith's like, okay, so she was, she was 20 when she started. So let's say she was like 21. So a year passed. That seems really interesting. That, like, going to do that, close friendship with bonds and all that. But knowing people who develop games, they're like, mm, it took like about a month. All right, not in this case. It probably took like half a year or something, but it's one of those situations where it's like, I have my own headcanon. Don't don't try to interfere with it. Of course. We'll show that thing. It is a thing. Yes, so we can kill it. Certainly will. I I I actually do want to see like some fan art of like Rita older. Rita That's and Carol would be like very interesting to see what they look like older. Good work. Sorry for making your work right before the final battle. Don't worry about it. I'm a member of a guild. I have to do something. You're technically a leader, too. Hey, Raven. It's nice to be able to do things for others. Hmm. Oh, yeah. Such grown up words from Master Carol. Yeah. I never did stuff just for other people. I wanted to show others that I could do stuff. I thought that was my dream, but I guess not. To make a guild, to make the guild big, to be a respected boss. All boys have those dreams. It's fine. But that was all just so I would look cool. I mean, there's so much you can't do alone. That is true. I guess so. I thought I had to do it alone, or I'd look bad, or it'd be worthless, or whatever. That's not helping people. I see. If you work together, you can do a lot more and make a lot more people happy. I realize that traveling with everyone. I like that a lot more. Hey, yo, Carol. Mr. Carol, you are something. So far ahead of this old man. You are cool enough, just as you are. You're cool too, Raven. Not as cool as Yuri, but... Oh, I'm hurt. That's fine. <laughs> so what's your dream, Raven? me to be stinking rich with bevies of gorgeous women all around mm. I'm kidding now hmm. finally back to just living so I guess my dream is to be able to dream again someday I mean that could be a dream for itself yeah pretty hard but I'm sure you can do it 
Thank you. I think I'll get it. Hey, is your heart okay? Yeah, it's weird, but it's fine. Even if I work it hard, it just keeps going. I guess that's the effect of the spirits. I guess this plan isn't all bad. I'm glad I met everyone. I mean, you too, of course. I'm glad I met you too. Really. We're gonna win tomorrow. In a big way. All right, we should get to bed soon. Lack of sleep is the elderly's worst enemy. Okay. That's true. Night. That's anyone's our worst enemy. Lack of sleep. Dreams are so not my style. But here I am, dreaming. <laughs> and my computer did dumb. Oh, geez, I'm gonna have to stop the recording soon. <laughs> It's almost time. Yeah, I start to think about it and I can't sleep. You get that way too? You say it like I'm made of iron or something. Yeah, you're not, Yuri. You've made Do that you clear plenty of times. You? Well, I'll repeat understood. Sing a giant wheelbarrow head out of here. Thank you. <laughs> it's warm. That has to be the stealth 19 now I think about it, huh? It's ironic that we're actually using Alexei's research to fight it. If they had only been able to think of others. Yeah, but they made their choices. Nothing we can do about that. Choices? You've always made your own choices, haven't you? I figured if anyway. someone's gonna choose, it might as well be me. And I won't find out if I made the right choices until the end. But that's wonderful. Making a choice is so hard. You made your own choice too. I think I figured it out while traveling with you all. I think this is the one that plays uh, Ring a Bell. Turn it up a little bit so you hear it. Yep. The Yuri and Estelle conversation is the one that plays Ring a Bell. To live means to choose. Whoop. And to have the resolve to make those choices. I think that's kind of overdoing it. I always just played the role I was given. I was happy to heal people and be thanked. But then I learned my power was poisoning the world. Someone was always using me. What about now? I... I don't know, but I feel like I'm here doing what I am because it's my choice, my wish. I'm glad I okay. came on this journey with you, Yuri. Me too. I wasn't yeah, too sure what it's good to have a healer around. To take you out of the castle. <laughs> there, there's no other reason why I like sure. Estelle, but like, her character, like, I'm sorry, I can see her enough about a healer. <laughs> I like traveling. Lots of different people, different experiences. We traveled the whole world, but I never got tired of it. I th think I'll just keep on going around. And keep helping people in need. Of course. <laughs> yeah, maybe there's some tomboy princess out there being chased by an evil monster. You're mean. <laughs> oh yeah. It's strange. Right now, I'm not scared at all. If anything, the That's thought good. that a new world is about to dawn is... Exciting. The Autophagos won't kill us. We'll live on. And I'll be able to stay with everyone. With you. Oh. You know what that reminds me of, and no one's gonna get this. It reminds me of Junpei Thanks. and um, I feel Akane same. from Zero Time Dilemma, but less death and less destruction between the two. Let's get it over with, and live on in a future we choose. Okay. And with that, our our heartfelt warming uh, reunion with everyone is over.
Oh, or not reuse, but like my understanding characters. Yes, I did. Like a log. The bed was so much more comfortable than when we were here before. Yeah, the whole town is in really good shape. Oh yeah. So this nice needs a name. All right, naming genius. Give it a shot. Oh great, Carol. Okay, okay. Scrappy handcraft. Thank you. You suck. No, no, you deserve that, Carol. Um, the light that melts away the snow. Arnian, how's that? Arnian. I think she does. I'm gonna forget it. Now it's got the imperial seal of approval. That settles it. Fantastic. I'm all done too. Rita's gonna go. We got a new sword. Damn. Asperia number one. This is Yoder's sword, isn't it? What? Is it really okay for us to use that? It's just the right shape and size. Plus, it's forged from rare metal. If I recall, rare metal is quite scarce and known to be exceedingly durable. Listening to your discussion made me remember this sword. I'm utterly incompetent with swords, so I'd be delighted if it was of use to you. Somehow it already feels different. It is a decent blade. So then this one would be Vesperia number two. It doesn't matter what it's called. It's almost time. Yeah, it kind of does. Yeah. This time it really is the final battle. Leave the construction of the Thankfully. last network to us. Wait, Commandant, you should go with them. Sodia? Hello. No one knows what might happen. They will need your help. But the knights have been tasked with persuading the people to help with the Blastia. I mean, they can do that themselves, I would imagine. I'm well aware that we will not succeed without the people's cooperation. Don't worry. I'm here too, after all. Very well. Yoda says, yep. Sodia, Witcher, even though we'll be working separately, we are still a team. Remember that, if nothing else. Yes. Okay. Okay. We have discussed the Blastia and spirits, and what to do after everything is done. But I think it will take okay. time for some to accept this change. Oh, no, die, Yoda. Many people will be so lost. However, they cannot live in a new world without accepting the changes. You're right. I will start by talking with the people here. They built this wonderful city of Arnian from nothing but a plane. Yes. Well, that's good. The residents that is that should accept not good, that's true. Good luck. No one would listen to me even if I tried. No way. Estelise. I guess true, though. Everyone, take care. And here we go. The determined ring the bell. I don't know if it's called determined ring the bell. This is the one I'm gonna, I'm gonna, gonna say about it. The land of hope, Ardian. Okay, so I have something to announce, and we do this off camera. We're, you're, you guys won't be able to see a cutscene. That's about it. Stop working for a moment. His Majesty Yoder has something to say. Ah, crap. More cutscenes. Never mind. I have something very important to tell you all. This will affect the Empire, the Guilds, and even the Entelikea. Are there any Entelikea no left? Be okay. They believed in us enough to send us. Let's believe in them. Yep. Yes. Also, I love Ring a Bell as a theme. Every Tales of game has such a good theme. Ring a Bell is probably the best to do. of the more modern ones, at least. Or like the, I guess, kind of like in the still. Do you think? I mean, I can't say modern ones because this is kind of like an older game from the series. This one speaks volumes more than I would say White Wishes did for me as uh, Tales of Grace's F. But it doesn't speak as well as uh, Karma from uh, Tales of the Abyss. I actually want to find like an extended version of this and like have it play in the background every time, every time I'm recording something or something. That'd be great. Desperia 2, the the the, the true creative victory. Uh, uh, the, the, the recent designs of Desperia uh, 1, it's all been played for uh, for Brave Desperia. And now Flynn the, uh, has earned the title of friend, uh, friend to the End. And everyone is in the party now. We currently have nine playable characters. 
Okay, so what I was going to say, off camera, I'm gonna be doing this, and you guys won't be, you guys will be able to see one cutscene. So, oh, boohoo! Uh, I'm gonna go around to each of those uh, forgotten shrine places, the air credit. I'm gonna go to the air credit, and I'm gonna connect them all to the sunken grotto. Uh, let's get. It. You will not see a cutscene because of that, but it's fine. I'll just basically explain what's gonna happen with that. Basically, it's gonna be like, or it's gonna be the equivalent of, uh, what the crap was I talking about? It's gonna be the equivalent of, uh, what am I trying to freaking say right now? I am really dumb right now. It's gonna set us up for an optional fight, so you you just won't you won't be able to see a cutscene of us connecting all four of them. But when all four are connected, we'll have a cutscene, and then we'll uh, we'll do a secret fight. Before we take on Duke in uh, the Tower of whatever the hell it's called. So, next time, I will see you guys later for an optional fight. Bye!